And we're also learning more about the man who was killed. 50 year old former Buffalo Township volunteer fire chief Corey Comparator, who was said to be protecting his family when shots rang out. KDKA's Chilicase Adele spoke with colleagues at the volunteer firehouse that he called home about the man he was. Buffalo Township's fire chief tells us Corey Comparator loved three things God, his family, and his dogs. He also loved serving in this community, volunteering here at the fire department for decades. Black bunting hangs over the Buffalo Township Volunteer Firehouse. It's on a truck here and on Corey Comparator's stall. It's a way to honor when his death is so hard to grasp. Just one of them things is trying to run it back through your mind on how and why it happened. How and why are questions many like Second Lieutenant Craig Serencioni are asking today. Comparator was killed at yesterday's rally for former President Donald Trump in Butler County. Really didn't know what, like, what to feel. I mean, I was trying to put it all together. People here describe him as selfless. Words Governor Josh Shapiro echoed today. Corey died a hero. The Corey dove on his family to protect them last night at this rally. Corey was the very best of us. May his memory be a blessing. Comparator gave himself to his community for years. He joined the department in 1994, serving as fire chief a little while back in the early 2000s. For his colleagues to hear the heroic way in which his life ended Saturday, they're not surprised. Not in the slightest. It wouldn't even have surprised me if it was a complete stranger he was doing it for. Serencioni says he's baffled someone would take someone's life in the name of politics. When I've seen this world change so much in my years, and it just worries me that how extreme everything's getting. He says the way his firehouse brother lived is a lesson for all of us. I want people to understand that he was a man of love and not hate, and that that's what we need to pursue right now. Love, something Comparator pursued to the very last moment of his life. Friends and family have set up a GoFundMe for Comparator's family. The fire chief tells us they'll be looking for ways to honor him in the weeks to come. In Buffalo Township, Butler County, I'm Chile Casiadele, KDK TV News.